today we're going to turn this massive gentleman into the fastest being in the universe. And we've already got a Batman bike, so we've already got that part figured out. The faster we go, the more money we get. Every 10 meters, we get $5. We can use that money to make our idiot's muscles bigger. But today's really all about speed. So we're gonna upgrade that. We're now going 1.07 meters a second. We've already gotten so good at this, we hit level 3. <laughs> but we're not gonna stop. He doesn't get a break. He's literally gonna be a shooting star. <laughs> we've already made him go insane. He's only been riding for 5 minutes. It seems we pedaled so hard, we made these appear out of nowhere. Anyways, we got another $100 to spend, we're just gonna spend it all on speed. Not the drug kind, but the like physics kind. And we're already being forced into a challenge against a half-human, half-cat. Or actually against no one. I wasn't winning this, but with a little help of an auto-clicker, I think we're gonna get it done. I've turned the front of my bicycle into a literal sun. I'm pretty sure we're supposed to lose this race. But thanks to me cheating, we don't have to. But we've unlocked a new bike. We go from the Batmobile to that. So now we need to go five times as far for six times the money. So he seems pretty excited about that. But think about all that money. All we gotta do is go 50 meters. I walked 50 meters once. It was the greatest day of my life. We're gonna upgrade stamina to level three and stamina recovery and even sprint a little bit. Mostly because I'm a people pleaser and I needed to please the boxes at the top. Now he's getting into it. I've got to say, I'm a little sad about the speed so far, so we're going to need to fix that. $13 per upgrade, that takes us from 1.13 to 1.18. Now, if we really want the upgrades, we're going to need new shoes. Luckily for us, they're handing out the gems like Tic Tac, so $100 for 10 pairs of shoes. That gave us some very functional and cool C-tier cowboy boots. So putting these on makes us four times as fast and five times as cool. That's a little better. Now we're going through 50 meters in no time at all. We're going so fast that he's getting tired. I didn't know he was allowed to get tired, so we're gonna have to do something about that. Well, let's force feed him some stamina. And I guess stamina recovery is probably gonna be a part of this solution. So the items vaguely known as clothes are what help stamina and stamina recovery. Just like in real life, the clothes are mostly Superman outfits, but also a cowboy costume. Five times recovery. While he's going through stamina less quickly, the cowboy boots really put this whole thing together. Okay, stamina is going to be a very big thing, so we're going to give him lots and lots and lots of stamina. The problem is the cowboy boots are too powerful. They're making him go too fast and use too much stamina. So it's been $140 on stamina recovery. That's hopefully going to put him a little more in balance. And for some reason, we got more cowboy boots. I'm not going to complain. But what we really need is the hair at this point. That we can combine all the way to the cowboy hat. I just realized I hadn't yet equipped the proper outfit yet, that's why my stamina recovery was not keeping up. That's better, as hard as I can pedal, the stamina just goes up and up. But thanks to my cowboy hat made of rubber, we're going to be making more money because of it. Go my beautiful idiot, go. Ride like there's no tomorrow. I hit the button called cash bike and he's just forever riding towards that cash on a string. If he wasn't such a simple soul, he'd realize he could just reach out and grab that if he wanted it. And just like that, I have $8,500. So we're going to use an auto clicker on a speed upgrade button and um, it's probably going to do a lot. So let's try that again without the thing getting in the way. Speed goes all the way up to 8.26 meters a second. Then maybe we'll just give him some stamina for now and off you go. That's better. He's leveling up quickly too, but it doesn't take him long to go the 50 meters he needs. And our stamina is mostly keeping up. Oh, look at him. He's starting to get tired. He's going to do this for days. I'm not feeling overly confident about his stamina yet. He doesn't have a smile on his face. So we're going to spend uh, about $5,000 on stamina recovery. That will hopefully fix his attitude problem. It told me to open another box, so I did. Not only do we get new cowboy boots, but B-tier shoes. So we'll go ahead and smash these all together. Now we have a times two B-tier, so we get six times speed. They don't look as good, but they'll perform pretty good. Now he's getting it. He's going to be happy the whole time. He doesn't get a choice. I think he's ready to try the 100 meter challenge. He was probably ready a while ago. He is after all a cowboy on a bike. I don't even need to use my auto clicker. He's that good. And we crushed that challenge. So now we get a new bike. Or we get to upgrade this one to a gold bike. At this rate, we're going to be riding something amazing before you know it. We get $500 now for riding 100 meters. And our stamina still seems to be unaffected, so we're going to activate Cash Bike and really go for it. And there's the easiest $30,000 I've ever made. Which is all going into speed. So we went from 12.39 to 15.5. And that's something that's just going to keep going up and up and up. Stamina recovery, however, it needs to go up. Because we're actually burning through our stamina. Not quickly, but quick enough that it's going to annoy me. Probably nothing $6,000 can't fix. I mean, we're making quite a bit of money. But it could be more. We need a better hat. 
And we got a B tier. So that's going to give me a solid 16 times bonus instead of 7. And it just kind of feels right. So now we get $1,120 every time we ride the 100 meters and we can do that pretty fast. So let's try our luck with some shirts. Didn't get particularly lucky, but I think that should all combine into something new. The five cowboy costumes combine into a purple thing eight times. So now our stamina thing hardly moves a little bit. We're just a joker on a bike. So we got a bunch of different things going on. We activate a cash bike and now we're pedaling away with his boost. That actually gave us $65,000. So I think we need more speed. This is already up to almost level 200. We're doing pretty good so far. But you can never have too much speed. So we're going to open a whole bunch of these and get absolute garbage. So obviously I figure if I open that a second time we'll get luckier and we got an A tier shoe. Which will double our current bonus for speed. Now that 100 meters hardly feels like a problem at all. Look at that stamina recovery though. We're actually losing stamina. We're supposed to have unlimited stamina. But since we have $110,000, stamina recovery. A lot of stamina recovery all the way up to level 200. I know I should probably spend some money on other things considering the upgrades cost $39. But we can just make some more money again. It's easy. For $69,000, we're going to spend that all on sprint. I didn't even notice there was sprint probability too, so they're going to share a little bit. We're going to try and go sort of half and half. Well, we know of a 6% uh, sprint chance and a 270, 227% sprint speed. And then we can use the cash bike one more time to get us really ahead. Then it wants me to do a match chicken, so we're going to do a match chicken. I don't know what to expect here, but that chicken's actually pretty quick. Unfortunately for it, it's racing a clown on the bike though, so we have a good advantage. And for our trouble, we got a broken slingshot. That actually gives me a 50% high speed riding thing from the cat girl. What I would really like is some A tier hair. And I think the more we level up, the more high tier stuff we're going to find. I mean, it didn't really work there, but one day my idea might be right. So at least now our 100 meter dash gets us almost $3,000. $215,000, we need stamina recovery. Maybe we also need stamina. I mean, it is an $82 upgrade. So I'm going to spend like, I don't know, 60 grand on that and then the rest on stamina recovery. And then one single speed upgrade because he deserves to go fast. That's better. Even with the auto clicker, the stamina recovers faster than I use it. So it's time for a 500 meter race. It's actually very, very close, but we're going to do it. Which means we can upgrade our bike. It needs to go now 500 meters, but we get $15,600 for doing it. And this one also just somehow suits his character and the entire scene of what's going on. So now if we turn on cash bike, we're really going to make a lot of money. It takes no time at all to go through the 100 meters now. We got to do that five times to get a reward, but that doesn't take long. We need just a little more stamina recovery. Luckily we have uh, almost a million dollars and the rest of that's going to go into speed. Half a million dollars on pure speed. Perfect. We're going quicker, but our stamina is still recovering faster than we can use it. Well, mostly as it turns out. So we're going to do the cash bike and then we're going to buy more stamina. <laughs> just that burst alone gave us a million dollars. So let's try and spend $100,000-ish on stamina and the rest on stamina recovery. And then we're going to sit back and relax and let him ride just like this for a little while. Welcome back to unfathomable riches. A few minutes later, we have a modest $8 million to our name, which means $8 million in speed. Level 344, 53.46 meters, which I guess is pretty fast. But I think what would really help is 500 gems worth of shoes. We're going to get 55 pairs. And out of that, we got all sorts of different things. So we'll combine our way all the way down to the bottom. So if we combine these, we can combine the B into a double A. So we are slightly faster than before, but I was hoping that would be a little more dramatic. After buying another case, we can combine another B into another A, so at a 15 times speed. And he is really excited about that, let me tell you. We're going through 500 meters like nothing. But what we're really lacking is stamina recovery. So opening up a clothing crate, we got lots of B tier shirts. When we combine which, we get our first A tier and it's a cape with 20 times stamina and stamina recovery. Now we got a good thing going on. And now that stamina bar hardly moves a millimeter. And that's perfect because we can just leave him here doing this for 12 hours. Even my auto clicker got lazy overnight so he stopped running for some reason. But we have 25 million dollars to spend. So I think naturally 25 million dollars in speed is exactly what he needs. Which put him up to 73.55. So now he's faster than ever at earning us money. That little boost has given us almost a million dollars, so more stamina. Plus we got a free level 2 shoe box, so we've opened it. Which would have given a slight boost to our speed. But since speed is clearly the name of the game, the fastest way to do it is going to be opening level 2 shoe boxes. Let's open 55 of them. That put me very close to level 3 as well. Look at all those nice shoes. 
It's going to take a moment just to combine them all. But once we do, we are going to get into the AA section. So we went from a 24 to a 30 times multiplier. So 500 meters happens almost in an instant now. So we should probably try the 1 kilometer challenge with all our new speed. I think we're going to do it, but just barely. You need to be really quick to do these. After defeating that bike, we get whatever this is. It looks like a rusty spaceship. I did notice that we're getting close to a level 3 upgrade for shoes. So if we open one more of those, and maybe one more of those, we can actually get a level 3 box. Okay, we did it. We got to level 3. That gave us an A. Now if we open a 500 box, that put us halfway through level 3. We got lots of double A's. That's perfect. Just need to spend 4 hours combining all of our shoes. So we have a 7x double A, but we're going to combine those into an S tier for 66x speed boost. We need to go a kilometer to get our bonus now, but we're doing that in a hurry, and every time we do, it's $35,000. But now we're running into stamina issues again because of our super bike and speed. So for a moment, we're going to spend about $3 million on stamina recovery, then open a $500 crate of clothes. That pushes us into level 2, so I think this is going to be a level 2 crate. We got all sorts of different stuff. So we're going to work our way all the way down once again. Well, we have a 2 times A now, but... That's not good enough. We're going to keep opening boxes until we get what we want. There's an S tier. We jumped right over double A to an S. So we're going from what was like a 22 times bonus to 125 times bonus. Now we're a police officer vampire. But I'm pretty sure stamina won't be an issue now. But we still need more rewards. We did get a double A haircut. We're going to open one more box that pushes us into level 3. Where there's another double A. So our cash and experience acquisition went from 40 times up to 107. So now for riding a kilometer, which we're doing in an instant, we get $100,000. We should probably also race a pig at this point. He looks pretty quick. He is pretty quick. But I think we're just barely going to beat him. And I don't know what shoulder is, but we have one kilometer, we get 300 gems if we do it. We're getting so good at riding a bike, we're not even riding the bike anymore. We're just carrying it to where it needs to go. I think we're going to do it. This is how real winners ride a bike. Now we still need some better rewards, so we're going to get a few more haircuts. But you can just never have too much speed, so we're going to open up more shoe crates. We're getting close to level 4 anyway. Look at all those blues. And we got another S tier. So speed shouldn't be a problem for a little while. I decided to try the challenge to see if I could defeat the next bike, and I'm pretty sure I'm going to smash it. That unlocks a camo bike. It's going to be hard because once we get off it, we'll never find it again. We need to go 5 kilometers on this one, but it's going to give us half a million dollars every time we do. But that very quickly gives us another 20 million dollars to spend on pure speed. And then we'll leave him here running for a few hours and come back to our fortune. It's been hours and he's still going strong. Plus we're billionaires now, so we can add a little bit of speed. We're starting at 363 meters. And we're going to find out what $2 billion in upgrades gets us to 450 meters. The rest of the money's going into stamina recovery. I don't know how much that what how much that was, but it's probably a lot. But somehow I feel like our speed still isn't good enough, even though we're going a kilometer per second. Luckily I have 1,700 gems to spend. So naturally we're going to buy 55 pairs of shoes. That's a lot of shoes, that's a lot of quality. So let's do it again. There's another pair of S tier shoes and even an R, which is beyond S. So working our combinations all the way down to the bottom. We're left with a lot of shoes that combine into a double S, but the R is actually beyond all of that. We get a 450 times speed increase. So now we're going 5 kilometers in a second. We're going 5 kilometers in less than a second. But now with all this speed, we have stamina problems. So we're going to need to spend 500 gems on new clothes. I mean, they're pretty good. The problem is we're still just sitting on our ba basic old S tier. So we're going to need to keep buying some clothes. But if I can push this into level 3 just like that, then we can spend 500 gems on these and hopefully get something amazing. I managed to get a double S tier out of the boxes. So we're going to combine everything down, but we're going to go from an S tier to a double S for 343 times recovery plus a Batman suit. And that's about done it. We're balanced out. We're using up as much stamina as we can. This is peak athletic performance. So we're going to try the next 10 kilometer bike challenge race. And as long as we're sprinting, we're absolutely destroying it. But ultimately, really, I just wanted an excuse to wear a Batman suit.